Hello and welcome to the demo of Community Data Platform's Housing Needs Assessment Tool for Communities. The tool first gives a snapshot of the community of interest. In this particular case, we see a quick overview of the Charleston, South Carolina community. We see that the number of households in 2020 was around 84,000. We see that the projected number of households in 2030 will be about 97,000. We also see at the end of 2020, the current number of units was around 94,000. And we also see that zoning in Charleston was not prohibitive. The city of Charleston was interested to see if it was a prohibitive factor to affordable housing. And as you can see, because of its large allowable units, it is not a prohibitive factor. Jumping down to the second graph, we look at a supply and demand analysis for Charleston. The Charleston population was broken down by income band, and then we also see the number of units available to that income range. So income you can see is broken down on the left by various AMI levels. Then we see the number of households that fit into that income band. Then we see the number of units available to that income band at an affordable rate. So CDP used the HUD definition of affordability, which means that a household is spending less than 30% of their pre-tax income on housing. Then we compared them and saw the mismatch. So if a bar goes to the left and is red, that means that there are more households than units available to them. If this mismatch part goes to the right and is green, that means there are actually more units than there are households in that particular band. So what we found for the city of Charleston is there is a need at the 30% AMI level, the 80% AMI level, and the above 120% AMI level. Then this project was done specifically for Charleston's 10-year comprehensive plan. So not only did they need to know where are the gaps right now, but how do we fill the gaps 10 years in the future? So what CDP did was broke down the needs by neighborhood in for Charleston specifically, that was looking at the planning, the five planning districts. So we see the need for Daniel Canehoy, James Island, Johns Island, the peninsula, and West Ashley. And you can see all of the breakdown by the various AMI levels at the bottom. If you are interested in seeing the mismatch in your community, please contact our team at info at communitydataplatforms.com.